Hey everyone, it's me, Doomlink, and welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Quest Swords. I believe that it is part 14, and it is the 29th of October 2015, not 2011. Which is what I said in the last video for some strange reason. But anyway, um, yeah, so this time around, as I did say in the previous video, we are going to be taking on Xyphos. Of course, if I wanted to, I could possibly get myself a little bit stronger for whatever reason by going to other areas within the game, but I don't feel the need to do that right now because of course we do have a new powerful sword, the Aurora Blade, as well as a new found shield. Well, not really found, new bought shield. Um, you know what? I don't like these. I'm going to use boxer shorts, no. Um, I haven't really looked at these. This dog's body armor, strangely enough, is better defense-wise, but this has a good effect on it which is reduces fire damage by 30%, so I think I'm going to keep that for now. That is actually a really good body armor, I have to say. Uh, this purr coat, <laughs> so funny, isn't that good, but yeah. Oh, we have two of these, Ruby of Protection. So that's what that was. We got that from the Tumblr last time, I remember. I was wondering what that was. Yes, I'm finally ready to take on the Deathbringer. Let's do it. He's very positive considering he is the bringer of death. But anyway, um, yeah, let's go on and try out the death bringer. As you can see, we can have a good look at what we get from getting rewards here. For S rank, we get a gold bar. For A, we get two iron ore, and B is a lava lump. So, guaranteed lava lump basically every time you do this. If you go to C rank, then you should probably just give up on playing this game. But anyway, um, we'll take Anlas because that is what we have been doing as of late. And let's go and fight the Deathbringer, I suppose. Well, it's not like we're going to immediately fight the Deathbringer, but he is going to be the boss of this area, I think. I think I just skipped the little cinematic that was demonstrating this area. Uh, I apologize for that. But anyway, don't really think there's anything to do there. As you can see, we have a new shield here. Very refreshing, isn't it? I've already messed up my attack combo there, which is unfortunate, but whatever. This guy is just being annoying right now. We would be pretty bad players if we couldn't deal with those ranged attacks by now, you would think. So we're going to have to be careful. Look at this guy, just messing up my hit combo. Just absolutely not good. I'm not happy. Alright, keep doing that. I mean, really, what is the point? I can clearly block at this point. This is not going to... Okay, bye. See you later. Bye. Ruin my damn score. The prince returns, yes. Uh, can we collect these? No, that's not something to collect. I'm trying to find things that we can collect on the ground here. Alright, more of these guys. Great. I'm so excited. Oh god, it's impossible for me to get a good hit chain going with these guys, because they just move so much when you hit them. It's very, very frustrating. Try and attack you a little bit. And get this guy. No, this is the worst. Absolutely worst thing ever. <laughs> I really do not like these enemies ruining my hit chains. That guy up there... We're going to fight soon. I guess he... Oh, no. Jesus, no. Um, I'm not impressed with the amount of damage that did, but whatever. God, how hard is it to hit these things? Can you please just attack me so I can hit you? This is the worst thing ever. That was just bad. Please, no more. No, I didn't ask for this. I really didn't did not. Anyway, antidotal herb, that's a good thing at least. Trying to attack these guys down here, yes we managed that. Whoa, shite. Oh god, this is awful. Um, I'll do a single heal on me there, and then use an antidotal herb and try not to get hit again. I could probably maybe use Sizz again, uh, because that's good. That gives me an opportunity to hit the enemies while they're lying down on the ground, knocked out or whatever they are. 
But anyway, this shouldn't take too long, this area, but I think it is one of the longer areas of this game, if I do remember correctly, because we need to get all the way over to that ogre that was back there previously. How did I miss that? That's so unfortunate. This is possibly the worst hit combo session that I've ever done. No, no, what? I hit you, man. I'm just not impressed right now. I'm really not. Are you calling more? Jesus, how many of you are there? No. I really don't deserve this. How did you attack me again? This is just not impressing. I can't really tell who's doing what, really. It's a bit difficult to see. Because they just do these minor little animations and I have to try and notice them. Look, all of these enemies are designed specifically to have me miss attacking. If that makes any sense, which I suppose it does, but I could have explained that a little bit better. Yeah, I don't think there are any items for me to pick up here. Or at least things for me to collect. Oh, there you go, that's something to collect. 32 gold coins. I wonder if we went past any of those previously. I don't think we did. Oh, great. Another one of these guys. Really not impressed. Just need to try and be careful with attacking this guy, that's all. It does annoy me that he wastes his time doing these ranged attacks because it's not like they're eluding me or anything. I think I can deal with them by now. I'm going to try my best to maintain my hit chain from now on, guys. I'm not going to allow myself to mess up. It's not happening anymore. Collect this here. Nothing useful. Got one of these guys again. Our old friend. It's got a bit of a different colour to him, though. I had to shield that, because that was just annoying. Oh, Magna Shield. Cool. I forgot that Atlas could do Magna Shield. It's pretty good, actually. Probably could have done a little small heal with Atlas there. Doomlink Shield returns to normal size. I'm not sure if that happens after a confrontation or what. Because if that wasn't the case, then that Magni Shield didn't last for for very long at all. Doomlink obtains 250 gold coins, which is quite considerable. It was good. Alright, let's get this here. Medicinal herb. Why not? Alright. More of these enemies that we have fought many times in the past. I think we can deal with them by now, you would at least hope so. Alright, let's hit this back. No, I totally missed that. And I'm very unimpressed with myself for that. So that's the difference between these enemies and the ones that we've been fighting previously, I suppose. I want to use a heal on me there. In fact, we'll do two heals, why not? Unless is looking okay for health at the moment. Generally, we don't need to worry about our friend's health, like, compared to our health. Because I think we get prioritised when we get attacked, so... Yeah. More things to attack here. I'm not complaining. Good for the hit combo, I suppose. I just realised I messed up my hit combo again at some point, so... That's very frustrating. Uh, we want to go to the right side. Because otherwise we're going to end up going in a big circle. And it gets annoying. Actually, no, I think this is a dead end over here, so... Yeah, but I do remember that there's a good purpose for us going this way. We end up fighting an enemy that gives us a lot of XP. Yeah, I think it's this guy. Whoa, that was... Big attack, big attack there, buddy. I wonder if he's as strong as the boss that we fought previously. Uh, we'll probably use a mid-heal on Atlas there. And a normal heal on ourselves. Try and block this next attack here. Of course, those weren't attacks that we could hit back, unfortunately. Have to be careful here because, as you can see, he jumps back and that ruins our hit chain. That's nuts. That's... that's oh, no. Anlis just died. That's upsetting. Okay. <laughs> that means we are going to have to... Well, we have two Yggdrasil Leafs right now. I'll use these medicines on me here because I don't really feel like dying or anything like that. And... I think it would be nice to keep Atlas alive here. As you can see, using a Yggdrasil there fully heals him. 
How did I not shield that? That's absolutely ridiculous. I'm not impressed. Alright. This guy is very strong, if you haven't already noticed. God. Those attacks of him, of his, are very bizarre. I'm not impressed. Alright. Yeah, get over here again, mate. So this should kill him, you would hope. Damn it, how did we miss? I'm not impressed, everyone. I'm not impressed. Alright. Let's continue through this cave. I forgot that the cave was this big. I thought it was like a small cave and then there would be a dead end. But this cave is actually reasonably deep. I think this is optional, to be honest. Well, fuck. Okay, we don't have an option to hit that thing. It's not worth it, really. Oh, great, we have another one of these guys. How about we just use our Light Fantastic? Because he is quite strong, and we might as well use the Master Stroke while we have it. So is this a multi-stage? No, it's not. And it's another freaking figure eight. That is the worst thing ever. I'm not impressed. <sighs> and it wasn't that great, anyway. Alright, so I had to try and do vertical attacks there to make sure that I didn't miss any of those. Alright, so here is a chest. I believe that this has something good in it, if my memory serves me. A lucky bag? That must have something good in it, or something. I don't know. But anyway, let's go left. We ended up wasting a Yggdrasil leaf just to go in that direction, so yeah. Oh, we've got one of these rocks. When there's a rock in the middle of the area, you know what's going to be happening. We wouldn't want to miss any of those. Oh, wow. That worked out quite well. But yeah, if we did miss those, they would have poisoned us, of course. Because they were purpley looking. Basically, anything purple equals poison. That is the rule that you need to follow. Well, not really that you need to follow, but just something you need to keep in mind. Oh, Jesus. That's me missing... Quite awfully. I won't use an antidotal herb in case I miss again, because that would be a waste of an antidotal herb. Uh, boo, 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 boo. All right. That should hopefully be all. Yes. So I've got a 31 hit combo here. That's not too bad. I want to try and maintain this hit combo at least reasonably well. So let's see if we can maintain it. <laughs> I'm taking on the challenge. Oh great, more rocks. This is just annoying, really. Uh oh, it's our old friend. Or our old friends. I'm not happy right now. Uh, I don't really think Sizz is going to do too much. So I'm not going to use it. Um, and of course I miss almost immediately. These guys are terrible to aim at. Bloody terrible. I'm not happy right now, guys, in case you haven't noticed. This area isn't that difficult, but it is giving me some troubles, at least with my, um, what do you call it, hit chains, so this is definitely not going to result in an S rank, I don't think, unless I do manage to get a good hit chain by the time I finish this. I don't think my accuracy is going to be very good, but yeah, I think there's a good chance that I'm only going to get an A rank for this area, which isn't a huge problem because, of course, it is kind of like the last area that we go through, so it is going to be a little bit more difficult, but... Still, I would have liked to have been able to get a good S rank there. It doesn't really look like it's going to be that way for the moment. What? I totally missed that. That's just not cool. I'm not happy right now. Oh my god. Alright, that should be good. Now we'll use another antidotal herb. God, we're going to run out of these pretty quickly if I keep missing. Lots of experience, though, which is a positive. Alright. Collect that. Nothing useful. Now, we probably want... Yeah, we definitely want to go to the right this time, because otherwise we are going to go all the way around, because the target is this big ogre that exists to the top of this area, or a cyclops, or whatever he is. But yeah, this is the way that we want to go right now. This is connecting with the rest of the area. Oh, great. Got one of these guys again. As you can see, they're really doing their best to do something. 
Whoa, Jesus, how am I supposed to... I guess I need to hit them back with a proper directional hit. And by that I mean like, actually do a proper diagonal or whatever. Yeah, do your attack. I want to see how much damage I do to you. Not very much apparently because I can't even block this guy's attacks. Well, I do a decent amount of damage. Of course he's going to go back here and prolong the fight and ultimately make it harder for me to survive. So it looks like I'm going to need to actually attack back. Okay, I managed that. That did a lot of damage right there. That killed him. That's impressive. Alrighty. Well, I suppose it's considered to be very good if you do manage to hit those back, seeing as though it did that much damage. Alright, so we've been recording for 16 minutes, so we're making good time. We've gone through about half of this area, I think, at this point. Try and do a horizontal. Vertical. Yeah, look at that. That's that's bloody good. I didn't get that great timing last time, but we did all right, at the very least. Shielded that. Got a good hit chain going at the moment. Magic water. That's pretty good. Probably, we will probably end up using that magic water soon. I mean, I think that using a Yggdrasil leaf to heal unless there was quite important, because he is useful to us, at least in the healing department. So yeah. Oh great, this is another dead end. Whatever. Doesn't matter. It'll be useful to us anyway. I'm amazed that my memory of this area is just so crap. I keep on going to all of these dead ends. This is usually not something that I would do the first time that I go through here, but whatever. Might as well do it now, <laughs> while we're here. Collect that, nothing useful. Continue on forward. Alright, oh great, one of these guys again. And he avoids my thing there and ruins my hit chain. Thank you, sir, for being awful. Missed that again. Missed two attacks, real great. And then they both attack me. What am I supposed to do there? That's ridiculous. I honestly hate this so much. I almost want to use a Master Stroke on these guys. Stuff the hit chain, man. It's not worth it. Look at this. This is terrible. This is like really awful. What kind of crap is this? He's just jumping back and forth. And I missed again. Freaking crap. So what was that hit chain previously? Did I did I manage to get to the 50s at least? I hope I did. I do have a small chance at at least getting an S rank. Maybe. There is a small chance. I don't think it's the best chance though I could have asked for. This is so bad. These enemies are terrible, these stupid hands. I don't like them at all. Alright, so I'm gonna get... Oh, Analyst leveled up again, which is cool. I'm gonna get Analyst to heal me next time we're in combat. Actually, we don't really need to. We can just do it now. Break this rock again. Reasonable for the hit... Hit chain, yes. <laughs> Forgot what to call that for a minute. I like how it still gives us the text whenever we go and attack a rock, it says, oh, this rock is blocking our path, but you may be able to attack it. It's like, we get the point. Alright, it's given us something, a mini medal, thank you very much. It's another item for us to collect over here, let's go and get it. 20 gold coins, thank you very much. Alright, so it turns out that we did want to go around this way. I'm pretty sure there are no combats on the stairs here, so we're just going to continue going up here for a while. And when it gets to the flat, yeah, here we go. <sighs> okay, oh great, more of these guys. Let's try and shield that. Try and hit these guys if we possibly can. There's only one left, so that worked out quite well. Alright, do you attack. Yes, and for victory. Definitely for victory. I want to make sure that I can kill all of those flying bat enemies because those are the ones that like to run away and of course that's quite bad for our end score. If we 
keep allowing these enemies to die on us. Not die, sorry, run away on us.